Hey guys, como esta? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we are going to talk about week 6, 7, 8, and 9. Such a long stretch. I apologize. I got sucker punched by COVID. But anyhow, let's get started. So for starting week 6, I want you guys to be aware that there's going to be double work from now on. Okay, so for example, for week six, there's two things. There's a midterm, which is 50 questions exam, and there's also an assignment, which is a five pager. Specific instructions, same thing applies from before. It is a case study, it is a decision tree. There's going to be a link in there. You guys can experiment, you guys can research, and all that. I wanted to take this time for the midterm. Obviously, there's 50 questions in the exam. I feel, in my own opinion, as far as all the reading that I have done, as far as all the writing that I have done, I feel like the midterm doesn't correlate that much with the resources that they have provided. I might be wrong. I have to say, and I, I'm, I'm going to be really, really honest in 100%, I feel like this is the worst midterm ever, 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 ever that I have taken in Walden history. Like, I feel like it just didn't match what they provided as resources and what I've studied and what I've taken. You know, and it's just not me. I'm part of like a private group with my classmates in the class. They all feel the same way and I definitely agree with them. I actually had to reach out to the professor and also to the advisor to kind of just have like a quick meeting as far as um, I actually scored lower than what I'm gonna show you later on, just because they had to like give away a couple of points. That's, that's just telling you something, you know? But again, if you guys are taking the midterm, I'm, I'm really not sure. I don't have, I apologize in advance. I don't have any uh, any tips or tricks on to like how to study in Psycho Farm midterm. It, it, was, it was just a total C. diff show, I would say. Um, so yeah, that's that's kind of like my two cents there. I hope that, you know, by the time you're watching this and you're prepping for yourself, you find a way to correlate the questions and answer the questions and able to kind of like use your the resources that Walden provides. So moving forward, week seven, again, two times the work. This is for therapy for patient with schizophrenia. I did enjoy this piece. It's a little bit long. This is when I'm kind of like was recuperating with COVID. Just so you guys know, you know how minimal I can get. I, I don't like to really dig so deep that I'm, you know, writing 20 million pages because it just doesn't work for my life. So with this case study, or I should say a discussion board, which is quote unquote short answer as well. I it was, it wasn't like a short answer actually, at least to me. I had to write about four pages with six resources on the discussion board. And on top of that, of course, you have to go ahead and reply to two of your peers by the end of the week. So I had fun with, with week seven but it wasn't like really digging into it just because I wasn't really myself. For week eight, again, double the work. Therapy for patient with sleep slash wake disorders. This one, yeah, it wasn't really um, my cup of tea, but anyways, I did it. The short answer part, case study of a patient. Ugh, I worked so hard for this because just because there's a lot of like information and I had to kind of decipher down and I have to like tone it down because seven pages was is, is very long for me to write. Seven pages is too much with 12 resources. So I really wasn't keen on doing my work here on week eight, but I mean, I did it. I'm waiting for my grade right now. Of course, the assignment, five pages, there's specific instructions. You guys know the deal. All right, time for grade report. As you guys see here, week five, week six, I did really, really good. Midterm, here goes 66 over 100. So that's 66%. That's like my initial score was actually 58 over 100, okay? I didn't even make 60. So that's just telling you it's like the worst ever uh week seven 100 over 100 week you know because you know you doubled the work now so week seven assignment 92 over 100 i'll take all the grades with the midterm being a low score and it is 22 percent of our grade 
Unfortunately, right now I am averaging a 79%. So what is that? Like a C minus or a C plus? And remember, I kind of did fail the quiz as well. So in general, I've been doing good with my paper, writing papers, researching and all that. I am having a hard time with quizzes and, and, and midterms. Hopefully, hopefully we push through and get a good, at least a decent grade for my finals, right? If you guys have any questions or any concerns, please feel free to comment below. I answer them when I'm not studying, sleeping, working. Don't forget to like this video. I'll see you guys in Palam.